Americans are indulging in the world of fat. It's a comforting feeling of senses. Senses of its smell, taste, and texture that are simply intoxicating. Fat is a very precious commodity, and I think that the human brain have been built to recognize fat, sugar, and salt as part of the primeval survival mechanisms. Now we're handicapped because we have fat everywhere, but we still have those brain mechanisms charging away. And the paralyzations of fat is reaching an alarming high toll. 39 million Americans are obese. That's 29% above the ideal weight. And the numbers double every seven years. For those who are trying to cut the pounds and break the spell of the enchantment of fats, it's a challenge. Molly may not like this, but she is going to have a good healthy meal or my name is not Lunette that Clown. With healthy foods surrounded by the world of fat, it can be hard to try essential proteins and carbohydrates. There's the tunnel! Here comes the train! Chuck, chuck into the tunnel! Woo! The fats that we enjoy eating linger with us so deeply that anything that's not based on it can make us picky eaters. You're such a picky eater! I don't know what to do! With funding provided by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. Thank you. And by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. Major funding is provided by the John D. and Catherine T. MacArthur Foundation, committed to building a more just, verdant, and peaceful world. Additional funding is provided by the Park Foundation, dedicated to heightening public awareness of critical issues. And by the Archer Daniels Midland Company, 